Ray Moran with the IIBV here today with Yusani Moyo, who has a really fascinating discussion of a new valuation organization he's founded called City Financial Training Company. Yusani is an associate professor of finance at the University of Venda in Johannesburg, South Africa. Yusani, welcome. We're excited to have you here with us. Can you discuss the need for business valuation education in South Africa, the markets and the services that this will help with? Uh, thank you very much, um, Ray. Uh, thanks for having me uh, this afternoon and nice talking to you um, as well. Now, uh, to respond to your question, um, what has happened is that there is an urgent need for valuation um, education in South Africa and also in Africa especially uh, given the fact that there is no uh, specialist valuation a professional body on the continent um, and also in South Africa. And also uh, there is no uh, specialist training a provider now that uh, provides a valuation um, courses that can be ranked um, as world class. Now, what is happening is that most of the valuation um, on the continent and also in South Africa now is done by professional accountants. These are chartered accountants, chartered uh, certified accountants, chartered management accountants. Uh, they do um, all the valuations. Now, these professionals, you find them in big accounting firms, uh, small accounting firms as well, medium accounting firms, etc. Now, they are trained as accountants and later on, uh, obviously, the accounting curriculum would also include valuation. But then you don't have a standalone evaluation a professional body and also a standalone evaluation um, education a company. So that's what we seek uh, to feel um, that is um, in this initiative. And then in terms of the market, um, the market is quite huge um, in my view. Now, as I've already mentioned, we have got quite a number of uh, professional accounting bodies and also um, a number of professional accountants across the 54 uh, countries here. Now, each country has got um, that is a professional accounting body now that uh, trains a uh, professional accountant. So now these are currently um, some of them specialize in valuation, but then um, now uh, they don't have that is a professional body to belong to in terms of uh, valuation. So the market therefore will uh, mainly uh, consist of now the professional accountants uh, that is themselves now that are involved um, in valuation work. And then you've got the accounting firms um, that is themselves and they need um, therefore now that is specialist evaluation of professionals. And then you've got now that is um, academics uh, that teach valuation and corporate finance. Now they will uh, need this kind of knowledge that we're bringing now that is um, to the uh, continent and also um, that is to South Africa specifically. So there are also um, issues around CPD courses uh, for professional accountants. I think that is fundamentally important um, that is for us because uh, our offering um, is tailored uh, for all those kind of needs. Uh, you have some exciting plans going forward for City Financial, Busani. Can you tell us about them? Thank you, um, Ray. Yes, um, City uh, Financial uh, Training Company. Um, this is a newly um, established uh, training company. Now, our aim um, is to specialize in valuation um, education. Now, as you may be aware, we partnered um, with the IIBV, which is a specialist education uh, provider now in terms of valuation um, courses. And then we've also um, now partnered with the American Society of Appraisers, now ASA, um, now as they would uh, call themselves, now which is um, a professional evaluation uh, body. Now that is there. So these are our two um, major partners now in terms of our initiative. So we'll be working close now with them um, in delivering valuation courses um, that is in um, Africa now and also uh, that is uh, South Africa. Now our aim uh, already, the company is uh, already set up. Um, that is um, everything is up and running. Now we have uh, finalized all the agreements are in place. Now the NICE website as well, um, it is um, in place up and running. 
And then we will be um, launching uh, the courses uh, very soon, um, the latest mid-September, uh, that is all the courses will be available. Now, people can, or prospective students can view the courses on the website. We have got three categories um, of courses that we're going to be um, offering. We've got what we call uh, category A, uh, which are the core courses. Now, these courses um, would lead to um, uh, the ASA, um, that is a credential for those um, that is participant that successfully uh, complete the exam. Now, so the delivery for these courses will be through um, a three day to four day workshop. Now that is uh, for each course. And at the end, the students will sit for an examination. And if they pass this, this count as a credit. And then if they complete um, all the core courses, they can then uh, subject to them uh, meeting now the practical requirements, um, they will then apply for um, the ASA uh, membership and then they can call themselves that is specialist uh, business followers that is there. And then of course the second category of courses uh, that will be what we call the CPG courses. There are many of them uh, that will be offering a specialist courses. Now for those professionals that are already doing valuation um, and so on, so they will benefit uh, that is from those. Um, and then uh, also our uh, professional accountants as well, uh, that is a part of their CPG um, route. Now they will um, also benefit um, that is uh, from those. Yeah? And then we've got uh, finally uh, webinars and some which we call nano courses, very short courses, but specialists um, that is um, in nature. Now that is there. So now these are the courses that we'll be offering. Uh, that is a city financial uh, training uh, company. We are working closely now with IIBV and then also um, now the ASA. So all our courses are updated, uh, that is on a regular basis to reflect now the current state of knowledge uh, that is in, in the business evaluation world. Now, so um, that is what we're going to be offering to the uh, market. Um, now, so for initially um, our um, trainers or um, now the uh, academics are recruited from um, all over the world. Now, currently we've got very few from Africa, but as time goes on, now we're going to pick up more members um, that is from Africa that would serve as uh, tutors or um, that is trainers as well. Now we seek, now that is to partner, now that is with the IVSC, and also now that is with the professional accounting bodies uh, on the continent. You will be aware um, that is Ray, that what has happened is that the IVSC now is currently busy rolling out a number of standards uh, that is relating to valuation. So it is therefore important um, that um, all valuation professionals are trained on these standards. And that is um, one of our priorities as well. So we work closely with the IVSC now that is uh, in doing that. And then we'll also partner uh, that is with professional accounting bodies now across the 54 countries. Now, partner with them, we are not going to compete with them, we want to complement them and then um, help their members as well, specialize that is in business valuation, which we think is very important in their daily um, activities uh, that is there. So we see uh, both um, the IVSC and also professional accounting bodies as strategic partners, uh, that is to City Financial Training Company, and we're going to work hand in hand, um, that is with them. And in addition to these core courses leading to professional designations, Visani, you also plan to offer specialized courses, for example, within extractive industries. Can you tell us a bit more about your plans for some of these specialized courses? Uh, thanks, um, Ray. Yes. Um, now, you know, um, the, each market is different, um, as you would know. Now, it has got different needs. Now, what we have done um, with the IIBB courses, uh, we have reviewed um, all of them and then seen that they are um, suited uh, for uh, South Africa and also uh, for Africa, um, that is as well. But then in addition to that, there are specific needs now that is for South Africa and also Africa. As you are, will know, now Africa is big in terms of mining. Now, so we intend to develop a specialist um, valuation of course for mining companies. Now that will be um, ready uh, soon. And then we've got also, um, now we've got a lot of companies that do uh, government jobs 
now in terms of fixed term contracts um, and also for listed companies as well. So we we'll need a specialist uh, course um, in terms of that, um, that is for companies with fixed term contracts, because you don't know whether it's going to be renewed or not renewed, etc. And then we've got a lot of retail companies as well, uh, that is in the mid tier now that is makers and acquisition space now there are a lot of retail companies that are there so now valuation um, of um, retail companies valuation of mining companies valuation um, of manufacturing companies as well now those are courses that uh, we plan to offer um, that is in the uh, near future not forgetting as well uh, that is the startups um, we need now that is to cater uh, for those uh, now that is startup companies as well i know we've got some some courses in that but then we need specifically now that is for the um, african uh, continent and south africa as well now that is we need those kind of courses and you also have a link in your website which discusses and leads to the asa accredited membership professional designation, which I think is highly suited to markets such as South Africa, which is a very exciting development, Bisani. Yes, yes, it is quite exciting for us. I think is as I've already mentioned, now what is happening is we don't have a valuation professional body um, that is in uh, South Africa and in Africa as a whole. So our agreement with the um, ASA now is to have the African chapter, now that is of the ASA. Now this African chapter now will um, then service, um, that is all African members. So they will uh, part, be part of the ASA now through the African chapter, meaning that now they will get the same access to resources that are offered by the ASA. Now they will um, also attend same conferences now CPD events, um, etc. And most um, importantly, now the African um, members will be um, in a family of worldwide. Now that is um, um, ASA members. Remember ASA is um, all over the world. Um, that is in terms of this. So this therefore means that they've got access to cutting edge knowledge now that is in terms of uh, valuation and so they would access now that is all uh, valuation courses um, and experiences now that is share uh, that with their uh, now other uh, colleagues as well so this is quite exciting uh, that is for us and also the asa um, that is as a whole so this initiative in my view is quite relevant and it will benefit um, that is valuation professionals um, here in South Africa and also um, that is across the 53 uh, countries here on the continent as well. So this is very um, important um, that is for us. Thank you. Yeah, and I know what the entire valuation profession worldwide finds very exciting is the fact that you'll be offering this education throughout sub-Saharan Africa. That's just a huge development for our profession worldwide. So we're really thrilled to uh, watch the startup and to follow your progress. Yes, um, as I've already said, um, for me um, or for us as um, now City Financial Training Company, this is quite exciting now because it gives us the opportunity to work with the IIBV now and also work with the ASA and most importantly, work with African uh, business valuation uh, professionals and also uh, that is the professional accounting bodies which currently um, train um, that is a professional, um, that is business valuation professionals. So this is quite exciting, um, that is uh, for us as well. Um, that is now our aim is to partner with our professional accounting bodies and um, complement their efforts now in terms of valuation um, education. So that is the primary um, aim that um, we have. So we'll uh, partner with them and then complement um, that is their um, effort. Um, and then um, as I've already uh, said earlier, most importantly, now the um, valuation uh, professionals will now have a body now through the African uh, chapter of the ASA, uh, which they belong to. Now, so they can share knowledge, they share experiences, now um, attend conferences um, and so on. Now they will learn a lot uh, that is from their peers, uh, from the US, now from Europe, um, from India, from China uh, and so on. Now, so that will um, that is, uh, help them uh, quite a lot. Now that is in terms of this. So this, in my view, 
Now, it is a very um, exciting time for the valuation uh, profession in Africa. Now, so we will seek to establish this. Now, create a home um, that is for the professionals. Now, where they can share knowledge um, and, and so on. Yeah. Now, thank you. Uh, I think this is quite exciting for us. Yeah. Uh, I totally agree. We can't wait to watch the launch and to follow the progress. Fasani, thank you so much for joining us today. I know this is going to be very well received news worldwide by our profession. Thank you. Thank you again. No, thanks, Ray. Um, and I look forward um, to another interview with you once we've launched. Uh, thank you. Keep well there in the U.S. as well. Thank you very much. Yeah. I look forward to it as well, Yasani. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. Keep well. Uh, bye-bye.